Hey YouTube, it's Oshu Harding One, and welcome to another LEGO Technic build review. And if you recall from the uh, mobile crane, I'm going to do a review as I complete each one of the books. So uh, what we're looking at today is the uh, summer 2013 set, 42008, which is the service truck. It has 1,276 pieces and has three instruction manuals. And I just completed the first manual. And so this is the first manual here that I completed. It has about 75 pages worth of, of instructions and this set has no numbered bags or anything so this is all the pieces that we have laid out here and anyway the reason I do this is I just want you to see uh, what goes into building these things and just to kind of give you an idea what these things look like in process it's kind of hard to see some of the inner workings once uh, the thing is completely built so I figured it'd be, give you an opportunity to see what it looks like as it's being built so this first build uh, book gets a lot of the inner workings completed and um, so we'll start with the front this is going to be the front of the truck here this knob right here is going to give you the two axle front steering so you can see here and here it's going to give you the steering so we completed that uh, also are going to have a crane or a um, cable for the boom to lift this is a service truck or a tow truck so that's going to be the crane to lift it up and I have all the power functions incorporated already so here's one linear actuator here's a couple of the other linear actuators and then there underneath here is where the motor is mounted and there's a pretty intricate gearbox in there So I, I have to say I'm pretty impressed. This set uses a lot different building techniques than I've ever seen before in some LEGO Technic. I know uh, this set uh, hasn't had a lot of positive uh, reaction. There's been a lot of people that have some negative uh, thoughts on this, but I've, I'm impressed with some of the building techniques. And one of the other neat things is this set is going to be pneumatic. So this is actually the pneumatic pump right here, and there will be a motor that spins that. And this is the the uh, the main feed line, the yellow, the blue line right there. So anyway, guys, as I complete each book, I will do an internal workings review and take a look at it as I complete each book, so that you can see what these things look like as we get through the construction of them. So this is book one, book two, and book three will be coming soon. And then once I get it completely built, I'll do a complete review of it. So that's it for now, guys. Keep jacking back for the completion of book two and book three and the complete review. Thanks for watching, guys.